The tool database is a catalog of all your tools. There are a limited selection that are added when installing ArtCam, but you can also add your own to the database. The most common way of opening the tool database is when you select a tool path and it asks you to specify a tool. This takes you to the tool database. Another way is to select it under Toolpath Operations. It is located on the top row on the far right. When you open the tool database for the first time, it will look like this. You can expand any groups that have a plus symbol next to them. For instance, metric tools will open up and have more folders that can then be expanded. When you select a tool, the right area of the database will show information about that particular tool. These can be edited, deleted, or copied. To create a new tool, copy an existing tool and then edit it. This will open up a new window with all of the tool parameters. First thing to do is change the description of the tool so you know what it is. You can change the tool number here. If you have an automatic tool changer, this will save having to change the tool number every time. Next, change the diameter to obviously the correct diameter. The rest of the settings, I would recommend you use the tool manufacturer's recommended settings. Select OK, and there will now be a two millimeter end mill in the database. This can be moved by dragging it. If I select the wood and plastic group, you can see that this is a top folder with a description. I can create a new group by selecting add group and give this a name. I can then drag and drop my new two millimeter end mill into this group. If I wanted to add some notes to the description of this group, just select edit and it will allow notes to be typed. Select OK when done. Now if you create a toolpath, there will be a new group with my tool in it that I can select.